It's Tuesday, and originally I wasn't gonna go into work. Looks like I gotta go into work now. I guess you're gonna see where I work. Corporate smooth. <laughs> this is garbage everywhere. The whole place looks like a war zone. This is my workspace. This is Westpac, the Westpac workplace. Um, it's pretty nice. So like a chump, I had to get a temporary pass today because I forgot, and it's always, I always forget my pass on the first day back at work. Just like a chump, I have to get one of these. Got to shoot on today with one of the big bosses, so that'll be interesting. And I've also got a package that came in today that I'm excited to pick up, and I know what it is. Um, I'm just, I pick up a package for Nick Koo in level 23. Yeah, so I got him, he got an email about it. Okay, uh, when was the email sent? Uh, like last week. Yeah. I got it! I'm very excited to show you guys what is in this box. Finally got home. Now, I'm addicted to Kickstarter. I love stuff on Kickstarter. I've bought comic books, I've bought artwork, and this, this is my first technology product that I bought. This is called Nora. It is an anti-snoring device. How it works is that this machine basically sits next to your bed and listens to you sleep. Now, if you start snoring, what it does is it readjusts the uh, position of your head so that you stop snoring. So this is the little sensor device that uh, uses to listen to you snore, I think. Little tubing. Looks almost medical, this thing, doesn't it? Cool. Well, that's it. I guess this is the little thing that sticks on your, stick on your wall or something. Maybe I'll stick this in my bed, I guess. This is the pillow slip that you stick into your pillowcase which I suppose put in on nightstand or overhead. Nora is the, fir the world's first smart contact-free snoring solution. All right, so as I'm sleeping, the pillow will inflate, as you can see here. So I guess I'll try this out tonight and give you guys a review. Well, I guess there's not really much to it at this point. I guess I gotta just put it in my bed and try it out and I'll let you know if it kind of does anything. I don't know if this is gonna work. I mean, snoring solutions generally don't work. So I might've just bought into the stupidest gimmick ever, but you know what? I'm willing to give it a go. And I'm not afraid to admit that I snore. I snore pretty loud and it's not something I'm proud of, but I don't know, it's the way God made me, I guess. But in other news, I came home today. You know you had that feeling when you've forgotten to do something, and then you know what I realized it was? It was that I parked my car in a spot that was timed. And I realized that uh, I had parked my car there for just a little bit too long. And unfortunately, I got a very nice fine from the council. Thanks, Rhodes. You're the best. Anyway, guys, I'll see you tomorrow.